somehow. Maybe cleaning? Oh, Inquisitor, I, um, I joined. Sutherland, your worship. I saw some bandits, so I came to warn people. I'll let your warriors know and then stay out of the way. You happier with the champion off with the wall? There were wardens in Kirkwall, too. Well, let me know if you find them. No, it's better you not. No. But you like demons! I enjoy the company of spirits, yes, which is part of why I do not abuse them with bindings. It isn't abuse if I ask. Not always true. Also, I do not practice blood magic, which renders this entire conversation academic. He won't bind me. He's a mage and he likes demons, but he won't help. Why would you want Solas to bind you? So I'm safe. If Solas won't do the ritual to bind me, someone else could. Will. Like the Warden Mages. And then... I'm not me anymore. Walls around what I want. Blocking, bleeding, making me a monster. A mage using blood magic could conceivably do that to any one of us, human or demon. You should ask Solas to bind you too, and then someone can bind him. There has to be some middle ground between do nothing and bind Cole with blood magic. Indeed. I recall stories of amulets used by Ravani seers to protect spirits they summon from rival mages. A spirit? Wearing an amulet of the Unbound was immune to blood magic and binding. It should protect Cole as well. The resources of the Inquisition could be used to find such a talisman. Good. They will not take me. Good book? Ah! I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, because I suddenly went blind. Oh, that. Just reports from Commander Cullen. You're an excellent liar. It's of no interest to you, I'm certain. It's a book. I can see that. It's... One of Varric's tales, Swords and Shields, the latest chapter. So you like to read? What's wrong with that? It's frivolous. There are more important things for me to do. That's just her favorite. Nobody asked you, Tevinter. <laughs> I couldn't finish the last one you lent me. I actually feel dumber for having tried. It's literature. Smutty literature. Whatever you do, don't tell Varric. Me? No, I would never. <laughs> They're terrible. And magnificent. And this one ends in a cliffhanger. I know Varric is working on the next. He must be. Pretend you don't know this about me. I knew Stroud, you know, not well. 
He led the Wardens near Kirkwall. Not many people knew who he was, but the man was a hero when it mattered. He wasn't the first good man to fall to Corypheus. He won't be the last. This story's no good for heroes. You must be glad that Hawk made it back in one piece. Yeah. Closest thing I've ever seen to a miracle there. <sighs> Hawk asked me to tell everyone back in Kirkwall where she's going. Fenris needs to know. Maker, I'm glad I won't be doing this in person. I'd better write some letters. Excuse me. Sorry, I really need to write some letters. Another time, all right? Is Knight Captain Ryland satisfied with his post? It's not an easy assignment, but if anyone can handle the approach, it's him. Let us begin. Right.
Inquisitor. Corypheus, he's a hammer. You're the Inquisitor, hmm? Honored. Don't ruin it. Ruin it? By pretending to something you're not. If you want things just so, what I have to teach will be lost on a fool. Your people asked for an artificer. My name is Three Eyes. Let's get started. Not yet. I'll come back to this. This is a fine fortress. It's very quiet. I wonder if you tire of quiet. I am keen, Inquisitor. I bring the Maelstrom, the Tempest. Are you interested? You've told me nothing. How can I know? Then you can sit and wait, or you can leap. They say you're in charge. I say, from where? From the thick of things? That's how you create victory. You wade in, smash a glass. You may think you now lead, but when you're the Tempest, you're someone to follow. Is this a magical talent? <laughs> No, Inquisitor. I will not assign a circle reading list or instruct the fact. Let your people do the preparation. I teach how to survive what we do. What do you mean by smash a glass? I mean exactly that. We use concoctions to cover ourselves in the elements. Like potions? Battle is no time for sipping. We use flasks of elements and smash them fast. It makes a mess, Inquisitor. That appeals, or it doesn't. I'm not signing on as a Tempest just yet. I received a bird. It had a note. Now I am here. You are here to train me? Ah, that is it. The Inquisitor wishes to become more than Inquisitor. Perhaps she wishes to walk in shadow, even as she is bathed in light. To save life through inflicting death. Childish notions. The profession of assassin has no time for it. Your profession has my respect. I mean... Really? We shall see. Let me first say, she does not want to be an assassin. Any more than she would wish to be a sword or, or a cudgel. Such are the weapons of others. They lack intent. She must become her own assassin. There is a difference. Let me next say, death has nothing to do with it. Death is the payment, the byproduct. Our way is between life and death. It is a door through which she will send others. I'm ready to start learning. She is willing. Will it always be so? There are tasks, processes, 
ways to train the mind and the body. They require simple motions, first steps. Then we shall see what she may become. <laughs> 